Hey guys, it's there we go. Hey guys, it's Clarence. So for today's video, we're gonna do a little daily vlog. Recently I've been doing a lot of like sitting in one place, playing games, doing interviews, and you know, I felt like y'all needed to come with me in my crazy dynamic life. So today we're gonna do what I always do when I have no other idea left for a video, and that's go shopping. I have to drop off a Goodwill donation. I have to drop off a Play-Doh's closet like trade-in. Um, we're gonna go shopping, thrifting, and then at the very end I can show you guys what I got and all the damage. I said we're going to a specific Goodwill now. We're set, we're set to go. Also, I have been in a creative rut recently. No freaking idea how to get out of it. As you guys know, I have a little bit of traction on TikTok. Like, I mean the smallest bit, like nothing, but it's kind of motivating when when you do well because then you're like, okay, I'll make more. Well, recently, I've not been doing really well. I guess I'm just not that funny right now. I don't know. I, I'm, getting, I'm getting in my head a lot. So that's kind of why I'm going out today. I, the reason why I'm donating so many clothes right now is because I was like, I don't know what to do right now, so I'm just going to clean out my closet. And so I cleaned out my closet and donate all that. And the money that I get from all that, which will from Play-Doh's probably be like five cents. I'll spend that on like more clothes. It's not the best way to cope with a creative rut, but it's it's a not the worst way, right? Right? Oh, it was my birthday last week. Woo! I turned 21, so I have my own little like quarantine gang here. This guy's on my I had a picnic, like a, just a small little picnic. It was like butt cold. And then here's the best part. I got champagne because, you know, 21, like, of course, drink responsibly. And it like spilled everywhere. <laughs> At the end of the day, I was surrounded by good people. It was fun. I, I would hope that that would have gotten me out of my creative rut, but it didn't. So um, we're gonna keep putting ourselves in the sun, get some natural air, and we're gonna heal together, guys. I'll see you guys when I'm there. Yeah. Oh. I'm not there yet, but I had something to talk about. So when I was having my picnic, the day was really weird. Weird energies, you know? I was really frantic the day of the picnic because I had class that day, and then I had work that I had to do, and I wanted to get it all done before the day ended. So I finished my class, I finished my homework, and no, my picnic was at 4 p.m., and I finished my homework around like two, so I was kind of like, okay. I gotta get a lot done. I had to go to the grocery store so that I could get like all the platters and stuff like that. So I walk in, I'm going to Walmart. Immediately as I walk in, I dart towards the fruit platters because I was so focused. I like, I had a list with everything I needed to get when I go in there and again, by the time I got to Walmart, it was like literally like 3, 3.30 so I was gonna be late to my own picnic. I go to the fruit platters and I'm looking around to see which ones that I want. And while I'm doing this, a mom next to me, she's like, excuse me, can I reach over you to grab like a little snack container thing? She's getting those like apple cheese pretzel things. And while she's reaching over, she grabs it and then she kind of like leans close to me and she's like, hey, did you hear that? And I was like, what? And she goes, when you walked in, that guy was yelling at you at the entrance. And I was like, what? I remember when I walked in, I heard a lot of noise but I was so focused on going and getting what I needed to get that I guess I just didn't notice it. He yelled at me. It was like this guy who was wearing all black. He had like tattoos and he was like, why do you have a mask on? But he was yelling at me because I had a mask on and he didn't want to wear a mask. But everyone that was at the entrance like guarding Walmart, like saying like, oh, you can't get in if you have a mask, was yelling at him. So that's what all this noise was. My dog just walked by it and he could have easily done something to me but I just was like doo -doo -doo, I need to get vegetables and fruits <laughs> also I don't get a basket or a cart when I go into stores like that especially when I'm in a rush because I'm like oh I don't need it I don't even need that much either like whatever no every single time nine times out of ten I need a damn cart I need a damn basket at the very least so I'm walking around and I had a lot of stuff in my hands <laughs> woman goes up to me and she goes oh looks like you need a car and I'm like I'm so frazzled leave me alone what the hell I needed is to get my stuff I thought that was less weird but more funny I was like wow that was a 
thing for you to say. <laughs> and there was a bunch more, but I, I was like, whoa, energies are whack today. And I really hope that everyone is experiencing this because it would be really weird if that was the world telling me to like, watch out, it's your birthday. So you better watch out, you're 21. A lot of dangerous things can happen when you're 21. We're here. Okay, we're gonna go shopping now and we're gonna feel something. Damn it. I got too much stuff to damage. I also forgot to vlog that I was already done with Play-Doh, so I'm just gonna show you guys a little bit of what I got, okay? Yup. A little backstory is I go to school in Indiana and I'm in Austin, Texas for the break. I got clothes that I thought would be helpful for going back to super cold, super snowy Indiana, so I got a lot of sweaters. First things first, got this cool knit sweater in kind of 70s. Next thing I got was this hill figure hoodie and does that say? Wait a damn minute. It's Harry Potter. Honestly, that's even cooler. Yeah. And the next thing I got was this tight high neck light brown uh, dry fit. I also got another sweater. It's just brown, whatever. I got another sweater, also navy. It's a polo one, so I like the light blue. So from Play-Dohs. Fun fact, since I gave my clothes to Play-Dohs, I got all of this for $2. So the first thing I got was this uh, Harley Davidson shirt. It says Austin, but it's like Harley Davidson, so yeah. Next thing I got, another Harley Davidson shirt. It's like in, in, what did you call it? Ingrained? Stitched? I don't know, Harley Davidson Jamaica shirt. And then I got, I got these like khaki pants. I like them wide-legged, but I have a really like thin, Waist on thinner. I have a really thin waist and this would help just me like Help it fit fit more to me and then the next thing was just these black black khakis Which I've been looking for for a while so honestly those these pants are kind of the most things I'm most excited for and then the last thing I got was this brown San Diego hat So maybe when I come home, I'll like put outfits to it. Um, oh my gosh, no, I'll wear the outfits tomorrow, which you guys will see in the video. But no, I will wash these first because you guys, I got this really nice bag. That I put, I made a TikTok about it because I put it, I got a really nice leather bag and I put it in the bathtub because I wanted it to, to get cleaned. Let me just tell you, no, I'm just gonna insert the TikTok. It was so gross. I remember how I was washing my thrifty bag that I got and the water turned yellow. Well, I left it in overnight and ew, 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 poopy purse water. I'm gonna drink it. Hello, hello, hello. Don't in class. That class really got me. I'm exhausted. Our professor doesn't let us mute ourselves. What if I have to like fart? or sneeze, or burp, or not pay attention, you know? I showered! Oh, I look worse. Okay, I feel better, guys. I feel better. I blasted some Lizzo while I was showering, so that's all that matters. I feel better on the inside. And now we're gonna change ourselves to look better on the outside because we got some clothes to try on! Don't judge me, I'm wearing the same shirt that I was wearing before I took a shower. You know, I don't wanna do the extra laundry. First thing I got, I showed you guys this earlier, it's this brown sweater, so then we're gonna put an outfit on right now. <laughs> Get it! <laughs> the poopy purse bag just evolved into the perfect purse bag, am I right? I don't know, I really like this one, right? Yeah? Okay, okay, we'll keep going. <laughs> okay, so the next thing I got, like I showed you guys, this outfit is stolen by from Pinterest. Very much Pinterest plagiarized. Look at that. Wait, actually guys, I'm gonna wear this one that I showed you earlier, but yeah, this shirt's cool too, but I think this one would look better with the outfit. Sorry, switching it up a little bit. <laughs> okay, next fit. I hope this looks good in camera because I really like how it looks. You can put this on like this. You can put this on like this. Ooh. Or you could just swing it around. I'm gonna swing it around because I wanna show people this Harley Davidson Jamaica shirt. I'm actually starting to surprise myself. I didn't think these were gonna be that good, but they do look pretty good. The next time you see someone on a motorcycle, it's probably me. 
<laughs> this next one is a sweater, and as you can very <laughs> evidently see with this lighting, there's holes in it. So I'm gonna actually fix those, but not today. Um, because, oh my god, guys, please comment down below if you hate my hair. Come on, just give it, give it to me straight. Next fit. I, you know what? Who cares if it doesn't look good on camera? It looks good on me, and that's all that matters. And all these holes are quite horrible. Or holeable. Good one, good. This is extremely uncomfortable. This is so itchy. My body feels like I'm, you know, getting destroyed by porcupines. It's so horrible. I don't know, I guess I think I'm just gonna wear an undershirt. So, yeah. Okay, so the next thing I got was this black blazer. I wanted an oversized blazer. Transition moment. I'm getting more awkward at sanding and just this far from the camera. This outfit might look a little bit familiar and the first place this outfit might be recognizable from is my video from last week, my interview video. And then the second place could be from my TikTok, which probably is what most of you guys are probably like. I copied this outfit from TikTok. Nope, I didn't copy it from TikTok. I copied it from James Charles' house tour video. Ah, uh, gotcha! Oh, this can also go with sunglasses. Serving you men in black with big forehead. Mm. So the next thing, y'all saw this one. Quarter zip, half zip. Quarter zip. Okay. Not sure how I feel about this one. This is the outfit. I don't really know what I could do. I look like I own the Yankees. I wear a lot of baggy clothes now, so anytime I wear something that's skin tight, I feel like the guy from Incredibles that Violet liked. This you? I feel like I'm gonna get another hate comment for this, but honestly, for everyone that gives me hate comments for my fashion, thank you, because you make me very self-conscious. And sometimes it works, but most times, it doesn't work. But keep commenting though, it really does promote my stuff. It's honestly sometimes better than a subscription. But if you subscribe and give me a hate comment. But yeah, those are my outfits for today. I hope in, in some way these might have been helpful. I don't know. I said yesterday in the car that I was in a little creative rut and honestly, I kind of still am. All things are good. This happens to the best of us. Um, it's just nice to have a few people that I can talk to. But if you are a creator watching this and you get in creative ruts a lot, please reach out to me, not because I'm gonna ask for help. I just think it would be best for us to just always like have ideas to toss off of for one another. So all things are good here. School is about to start and classes are about to start. So wait a damn minute. So <laughs> this season of me posting twice a week will sadly come to an end just for a little bit during this semester because um, I do have to kind of focus on my classes again so but don't worry I'll be posting once a week as usual thank you guys for watching if you like this video please consider giving it a like or comment any idea that you have for the future in terms of shopping over half of you guys watch my videos consistently but are not already subscribed so please consider doing that it really 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 does help with all that being said to all my besties and all my mamas that's it